Warning, some viewers may be too serious to enjoy the following video. Yes, saw dude. So that's actually the exit for Michigan's Adventure right there. We're passing it because we got the plus one king right here. Yeah. We love it. We got to get the new SBF hamster wheel at Craig's Cruiser. It's a half hour north of Michigan's Adventure. For those of you who are unfamiliar, a plus one is when you go way too far out of your way to ride a single roller coaster that is both unimpressive and insignificant. This helps to boost your meaningless credit count. <laughs> this guy has written more random credits than probably anyone. That's why I'm in the 500 club. I am the plus one king. So McLovin already made us wake up at 7.30. 6.30. To go drive, what, two and a half hours? Yeah. Two and a half hours to ride a credit. Half an hour past Michigan's Adventure. Like, it's not even like it's on the way. It's out of the way. We had to go past the park. He drove eight hours to go to Little America, like, yeah. last week. Little America, Santa's Village, and Haunted Trail. He got seven credits. Hey, I got to 500. That's what matters. Is it, though? Yes. Whoa, we got more dead bug mangs. Oh. This one bled all over my grill. Well, they're not subscribing to the channel either. Hey, my condolences, but hopefully your family members will definitely miles. like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> There's the stupid credit we're here for. Yeah. If it's not open, I swear to God, I'll punch <laughs> you in the mouth. Dude, McLovin will die. I will die. <laughs> the hamster wheel is even a $1 upcharge. <laughs> but the one at Kalahari and Round Rock is like 10 bucks, so this is a little bit cheaper. Okay, all right. And it has more cycles. All right, we got our hamster wheel The hamster. The hamster. Hamp. Hamp. Hamster right wheel. Yep. Lovin doesn't die today, so that's cool. <laughs> you get to live today. Until the next time this happens. Valley? Whoa. All right, credit number 539 for me. Oh, congrats. I like these things. They're, the hamster wheels are fun. It was actually a lot better than I thought it was gonna be. It wasn't too bad. bad. The head restraints have really, really bad padding, so you really get worried you're gonna be heading yeah, a lot. Yeah, it's, like, like, it's almost like in Vertigo, like the padding they have. Yeah, it's but worse. you stay <laughs> pretty much in place, so yeah. it's not bad. And the flipping is actually like, pretty smooth. It's not bad. Uh, me and McLovin rode together, and ours was sick, because like, during the, that last hill, we would just stay upside down like, the yeah, whole time. Yeah, you inverted for a little while. <laughs> it was pretty dope. That was okay. All right, I guess we can go ride that awesome CCI now. Yeah, yeah. I guess so. Yeah. Let be running good today. Silver Lake, Michigan. Check out those sand dunes, man. One of the things I love about this state, just all sorts of weird natural stuff in it. Pretty dope. Yeah, does the Subi have sand mode? Uh, wait. Is this, this is where we scale the wall? Yeah, you can scale the wall if you want. Nate, floor it. Can I park here? Floor it, Nate. Don't floor it! Floor it? No! No, no, don't floor it! Okay, floor it! No! no. no. All right, we're in the dunes. Walking up a hill of sand is really hard. You just keep sinking. <laughs> yeah. Since when does grandma go to the dunes? Grandma took a little spill at the sand dunes today. Broke her cockix. Since when does she go to the dunes? We made it. It's a workout yeah. walking up hill on sand. Nate's a mountain hiker. He said that was tough. Going? Yo. Yo. Look at that. I've been waiting for this one for like over a decade. 20 years, over 20 years I've waited to ride this roller coaster. Oh, it's running good. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah. nice, dude. This ride is just all airtime hills. It's a B&M Hyper made of wood. That's what it looks like. Yes. Let's go. We're like so excited to be here. I'm more excited for this than I was for Cedar Point. Drop tower. Nice. So uh, we might have to buy a fast lane just to get this credit. Cause all they do is they just stack up cars on this ride. They've got like three of them off the ride, the track today, and they, the others are all just stacked. <laughs> Let's go ride Shivering Timbers. Let's go ride Shivering Timbers. God. I built this roller coaster in Roller Coaster Tycoon when I was like 10 back in like oh, yeah, 99. Roller Coaster Tycoon came out. This is a bucket list moment for me. Oh yeah. 
Yes, dude. <laughs> yes. First time on Shivering Timbers. I've been waiting for this for like most of my life. Me too, man. Me too. Sorry, it's me. I saw this on the, the travel channel or discovery channel when I was a kid and I've been obsessed with it ever since. Okay. Now we're gonna get on the ride and it's gonna break down on the lift hill and we're not even gonna get yeah. on. It's gonna be dope. Yeah, it's gonna be sick. They're gonna like e-back us. <laughs> Can't wait. Gates are opening. Touch of oncoming riders. Michigan's adventures aren't responsible for the loss of the stall. Enjoy your ride on Shivering Timbers. We just got off our first ride. That was better than I thought it was gonna be, honestly. Wow. Air time for days. Every hill hit. You got the back car. Every single hill had air time. This is my favorite CCI. 100%. Yeah. Right. This thing blew me the away. Me too, dude. Me too. It's a little rough, but I don't even care. This is the best <laughs> <trip>. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, honestly, yeah. More than Goliath. Yeah. And this is how it's running. It's it's, it's a morning ride. This is how it's running in the morning. Once this yeah. thing like warms up even more. This is a top 20 roller coaster. Yeah, I think so. I think yeah, so, yeah. honestly. This is yeah. top 25. And even it has laterals too, like the turnaround and then the helix is like yeah, non-stop like lateral. So good. We're going back around. That ride is so good. Yeah. Honestly, if you haven't been here yet and you've been thinking about coming here, come to this park. Let's do it. <laughs> Over 20 years I waited to ride this. Yeah. Ride. <laughs> so, yeah, like his whole life, okay, like my whole life. The valleys on the outward leg do hurt. My yeah, back they're hurt. a little rough, but, but it's yeah. honestly for the air sign. It's so, it's so if they good. They did a gravity group recheck of this thing. Would be top ten. Easy. Oh, easy, yeah, easy. Yeah. It's because all the air times there, the yeah. speed, the pacing. Oh, you guys got to get out here. Yeah. So me and McLovin just rode in row two. Uncle Nate got row three. That was sick. The front still's really good. I think we're all in agreement that the front is a little bit better. It's like a little stronger airtime and the lateral still hit. This ride's great. It's hard to marathon though. It's yeah, a little rough, but, but, but it's, the it's best fun. kind of beating up. We just rode the corkscrew twice without getting off because people at this park don't like to go to the back car, I guess. Apparently. Yeah, there's no grouper, so they just decided like me, not to go. Me and Uncle Nate were sitting in row 11 and like we came back to the station, no one was there. And there's a line down the ramp, but we asked the ride up, like, can we go again? And he's like, yeah. We're like, all right, go. Cool. It's a yeah. great corkscrew too. It's, a, it's smooth, yeah. It runs good. I just runs good. So we just took advantage of people's stupidity, man. It's oh, sh they have mini golf yeah, here. Yeah, if you want to do mini golf here, they still have that. So. I want to go actually how much it is. We might be doing mini golf in a little while. So mini golf is $5 for 18 holes, but if you're what a platinum pass holder or just any pass I think holder? It's just pass holders. If you're a pass holder, it's buy one, get one free. If you want to do a round of mini golf in between your shivering timbers and corkscrew laps, go for it. Yeah. For sure. I've never actually done this mini golf. I want to do it. So fun fact, there used to be an old turnpike car, antique car ride that would go all the way through this infield. But now they just tore it out and replaced it with a whole new kids area, which is probably the only major development this park has had in like 10 years. Yeah, yeah. thanks, Levin. All right, let's go get credits. All right, dope. Camp Snoopy, let's send it. Wow, I really got details here. So they relocated their kitty credit from like what, like a, yeah, a little bit over there to put it here. Why? 
But hey, it's a new, they, new coaster for 2000 whatever. New coaster. Yeah. Yeah, what up, Manx? What's up, Manx? Yo, like, comment, subscribe, Manx. All right, Woodstock Express. So this is the clone of the coaster that I got stuck on in Texas because they locked us in the restraints. And then the guy walked away because he had to go to the bathroom. Why is this going to happen again here? Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> he locked us in. All right, I got to go take a shit. I'll be right back. <laughs> Kitty coaster. You know what time it is. Uh-oh. Oh, uh, it's Uncle yeah. Nate's time to shine. I already have this credit. Do I need a kid? Do I need a kid for this ride? I don't think so. Okay. No. We, we can find you one anyway. You're such a fucking hoe. I love it. You guys see that tire drive? <laughs> Yo, good. The boyfriend is a door. Make love it. Just got off Woodstock Express. That was dope. Yeah. The ride operator treated us like we were just like any other person. Like she's like, you guys want? Where do you guys want to ride? She called us campers. Yeah, she called us campers. <laughs> it was great. Like she, it wasn't like you know, any judgment. It was like we were still little kids. So yeah, she, she had to touch that ride through yeah, there. She's cool. She's really cool. Uh, the Kitty Land here is like the size of the regular adult park. Yeah. It's nice too. It's really nice. It's like yeah, all freshly redone. They did a good job with it. So, so I mean, that's two credits in the Kitty section. Yeah. So we're gonna go get the other one. The CCI. The CCI. <laughs> Man. It's the longest line all day. One train ops. Everyone knows it's a CCI. So they're all hype. Dude, look at yeah. the Oh, go, it's like a cable whip. This yeah. one has buzz bars, actually. We're about to get yeeted. Uh, okay. Dude, we should have totally got fast lane, man. They take a fast lane at Zack Zoomer. Yeah, man. What are we doing? Are crazy. We messed up. We messed yeah, up. Yeah, we, we really messed up. Yeah. Oh. Fast lane's only like 50 bucks, dude. Come yeah, on. we could use it to get this credit. We're trying to squeeze them into the train. You gotta get it, right guys? Are you guys on? Well, wait, Kevin already has it, has this credit. Alright, Nate, do your thing. Does he fit? He's got his outlaw run shirt on. He's on the kitty This place actually looks really nice. That looks awesome. This park's beautiful. Look at this lake. You got an awesome relocated at Bacoma SLC there from Geauga Lake. I haven't ridden that thing since like 2005. It's been about a to be long reunited time. with the uh, Serial Thriller. Serial Thriller. Unfortunately, yeah. it's not a new credit. Call for it you. by its right name Thunderhawk. Yeah, Thundercock. Thundercock. That's a dog, right? That's a little large mouth bass. A dog. Yeah. Baby dog. Give it some sun. Yeah, you got a phone? You got access to the internet, to YouTube? Do you know what a block zone is? Like, comment, subscribe. Check out El Toro Ryan and find out, fish. I mean, dog. So we're about to ride Michigan Adventure's newest roller coaster, which is a relocated Vacoma SLC that Cedar Fair stole from a park that they bought and then closed down. Yep. So they can put here. <laughs> Keep in mind that that means the newest coaster here is 13 years old. Well, yeah. before that, because it was installed in what, like 1990? Something like that, whatever. so it's yeah, oh, yeah. Like 20 years old. Yeah. yeah. And it looks really nice though, the, it does. the red the and brown paint. paint. Awesome. And the landscaping is sick too. Yeah. It's like one of the best looking SLCs. For sure. Same layout as Phoenix, but it doesn't do anything. Yeah, it's Phoenix, but Charles did actually built him in his cell, and it's slightly profiledly different, so it sucks. I mean, it's been making some really weird noises when it tracks around, so let's go. Let's go find out what's good with it. Yeah. I've heard some squeals from random parts of it, and some <laughs> you can hear bangs around the turns.
Flat Ride definitely looks like Phoenix. Does it ride anything like yeah, Phoenix? Yeah, but it was like <laughs> But it wasn't like bad. It was just like it's just, it's just really, really awkward. awkward. Like you could tell this was Din's first ground up yeah. coaster. Yeah. So Michigan's Adventure is like, I need a Woody, and Din's like, I got you, fam. I'm gonna build you Phoenix, and then you get that. It's like great value, Phoenix. So we just ordered food, but they're stacking hard. They're stacking yeah. hard. No one's getting their food. Shivering Timbers is right there. Uh, I'm gonna go try to see if I can ride Shivering Timbers before the food comes out. I'll see you guys in a bit. I'll yeah, probably eat right, the food. See, see what happens. All right, so I just left them. It's 2.23, Shivering Timbers is right here. Let's see what happens. No sign of a line so far. Uh, I think it's just a station wait. I'm totally gonna, I'm totally gonna beat the food. Kevin might even be able to come back and ride this or Nate. Right, welcome to Shivering Timbers. All right, so I just got off an awesome ride on Shivering Timbers in row three. Great air time, running even faster than before. It's now 2.34, let's go check on the guys and see if the food came out. My guess is that it didn't. No food yet? Still waiting for food, I'm gonna make a lap and see if we get our food by then. All right, let's do it. It's, uh, it's 2.35, let's see what we can do. Opening, I'm coming on, welcome to Shivering Timbers. Please look here. All right, 2.45, just did our second ride. My second ride, your first ride while we're waiting for food. Yeah, so it's better than earlier. I learned how to ride it so I don't hurt myself. Fucking awesome. Yeah, yeah. There's like two pretty bad potholes like on the first few big hills. When you're going up, when you're going up the next hill. It's like right as the transition ends, like where kink. you're going up. There's a kink and it yeah. hits so hard. Really hard. But I learned how to ride it now, you just gotta brace for it. And yeah. Stand up a little. I mean, don't stand up. You know, like just like get your butt off the seat a little there bit. There you go, yeah. And then the train, lifts up and then it catches your butt again. So you're not actually standing up. We're all about safety here. Hey, would you look at that? McLovin got his food. Well, we were able to ride Shivering Timbers twice while waiting for our food. Yep. Hey, two rides of Shivering Timbers, you guys ain't bad. Yeah. <laughs> So Shivering Timbers is something special. It's better than Twisted Timbers. It's better than Sky Rush. It's better than Superman the Ride at New England. It's better than Phantom's Revenge. Did I say that yet? This ride's elite. I am speechless. It's crazy. Get up here and ride this thing. It's amazing. Uncle Nate just overhyped that ride to so many people. Now they're gonna come here and be like, what? <laughs> that wasn't that was a good at all. Amazing. That was terrible. So amazing. No, it really is good. It's like a, it's a CCI voyage. Like it really it's is. insane. It's got way stronger air time than Voyage though. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. It does. It does actually. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah. It's better. Top 10. It just hit my top ten. Voyage has got a lot of. Like Voyage has got some extra aggression with the turns and stuff because there's more with the layout. But this is just an airtime machine. <laughs> you know, you can't, you can't beat that. There's nothing wrong with that. And oh. the positives are It does have good positive Gs, now. too. Have you yeah. seen me this excited on a roller coaster in a no. while? No. No. Dude, <laughs> no. Uncle Nate loves this ride. Oh I do, God. too. I love it. I so, love this ride. This yeah. ride's awesome. The only thing that sucks is the park it's at. I wish it was somewhere else, but I guess it's cool that it's here. It's a unicorn in the middle of Michigan. It is. All right, take two in the Wild Mouse. Oh, that's so oh, yeah. much shorter. Let's do it. Stack, 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 stack. Stack, 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 stack. That's the best wild mouse I've ever been on. Ejector. Ejector like airtime on wild mouse. Air time That's how Alan Schilke wanted this to run. No trims at all. No, it none at all. It just through the layout. It's awesome. <laughs> Way better than the one at Valley Fair. And then this guy back here, I'm trying to convince him that Shivering Timbers is his number one roller coaster. Like the way he's been <laughs> reacting. It's better than Sky Rush. It's I'm number one. It. You guys go get your footage. We'll see We're gonna go later. film that ride. I want to make a video on that ride, but he's gonna go. <laughs> he's gonna go ride that. And I know what the seats are gonna be covered with when I get there. Sweat. Yeah, and Uncle Nate oh, yeah. sweat. Uncle Nate yeah. juice. Yeah, Uncle Nate juice. Awesome, Uncle Nate juice. <laughs> So 
we're just re-riding now. What road do you guys want to go? I'm going to go front this time. 301. Yeah, oh my god. Dude. Oh my dude. god. 10 plus <laughs> rides on this thing today. Yeah, it's so it's, good. Yeah, dude. this is the top 20 coaster, top five wood for easy, sure. Easy. That's your number one, right? It's not my number one, but damn, is it close. <laughs> he should, he just feels guilty. He doesn't want to put it above his other like prize coaster. But the way he's been acting all day about that ride. Did I ride this thing like 20 times today? Easily, yeah, yeah easily. Yeah. It just <laughs> delivers so much air. It's got, okay, they said like before Steel Vengeance was made that the Voyage had the record for airtime. There's no way that that thing had the, the record. Voyage. voyage just turns and like 90 degree this turns thing, and stuff like that. This You're is, out of your seat for every four hill. Five seconds. Every hill has airtime, yeah. yeah. It's like being at Piper Hill. Just four plus seconds oh, yeah. airtime the whole way. The ride feels like a hyper, right back way. into your seat. Oh yeah. yeah, it's so good. And there's good positive G's too. You don't really get that yeah. when he's that up. Yeah, awesome this This has ride. some... You see, sky, track. Sky, track. track. There's a few <laughs> valleys where like, it, 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 it put my the head middle, down. The middle, it still yeah. sends it. There's no bad seat. There's no bad seat. If you've never been to Michigan's Adventure, you gotta Granted, get the rest of the park is not all that great. The corkscrew. At, cool. at least for this, at least for that ride. Is cool. If you take away Shivering Timbers, this park becomes Magic Springs. Yeah. But other than that, no, this park is sick because of Shivering Timbers. Get out here and yeah, ride it. Yeah, get out here and ride it. We hope that when you ride it, it's running how it did for us. We do hear that it can be a little moody, so sometimes it won't run like that fast. It can be a little slower. So we hope when you come here, it runs how it did for us. We're going to Kentucky Kingdom and Holiday World now, so we're riding Voyage tomorrow. Dude. I gotta compare Voyage. The today. Gravity Group version of that ride tomorrow, so. <laughs> All right, guys, peace.